If you've ever wondered whether creatine is worth it, stop scrolling. In the next 45 seconds, I'm going to answer every creatine question you've ever had. No fluff, just facts. Is creatine a steroid? Nope. Is it just water weight? Also no. Should you take it when bulking? Yes. What about cutting? Still, yes. Even if you don't work out? Yep. Is it safe? Over 500 peer-reviewed studies say yes. Can women take it? Absolutely. Will it make you bloated? No. Will it make you bulky? No. Does it hurt your kidneys? Not if they're healthy. So what does it do? It helps you push harder in the gym and benefits your brain. Yes, your brain. Research shows it can improve cognition, may help with depression, and is being studied for conditions like Alzheimer's. How much should you take? 3-8-G every day? On rest days? Yes, if you miss a day, just don't miss the next one. Loading phase? Not necessary. Cycle it? No, drink more water? Always, creatine or not. Which type? Creatine monohydrate. It's cheaper and outperforms all others. Best time to take it? Doesn't matter. Mix it with other drinks? Yes, hate the taste? Mix it with something you like. Pills, powder, or gummies? All work, but some gummy brands recently failed three RD party testing. I'll list them in the caption. If you stop taking it, your muscle creatine stores return to normal, but you keep the gains you made while using it. If you learned something, hit save, share this with a friend who overthinks supplements, and drop your next creatine question in the comments. I'll answer it in the next video.